on everybody? Uh, today I'm going to do a quick review of my wife's a 2013 Elantra, it's a Hyundai Elantra, and uh, this car is just about a year old, you know, give or take a few days. Um, the reason I'm doing this now is because I wanted to give everybody kind of a clear picture of what it's like to own this car. I mean, I've been it for a year, we've done, you know, a lot of driving, road trip has probably about, let's see how many miles are on this thing. Frankly, it's the wife's car, so I don't really know exactly. So right now it does have you know, 13,000 miles. So yeah, this thing has definitely been driven. And you know, one of the things that you know I thought of before getting this car was, you know, Hyundai. Like, really? Hyundai? You know, two years ago I would have, you know, would have never been caught dead in a Hyundai. Let's, let's face it, come on, people. Never in my life. But, uh, we looked at this car, my wife really liked the styling, so we decided to give it a shot. Um, you know, went to look at it, sat in it, drove it, she fell in love with it. So, you know, here I am today. You know, um, quality is actually quite good. I mean, everything is just really well put together. There's not many two... Actually, there's not really any pieces that just kind of rattle when you're on the road. Everything's good. Ride quality is good. A little little on the soft side, but it's actually, you know, quite nice. You know, it does have a four-cylinder 1.8, 148 horsepower. Definitely not going to win any drag races in this car, but, you know, it does get, well, on average, probably about you know, 35 to 38 MPG on the highway. Uh, this is my wife's car. She does probably about 90% city, so she's getting probably, you know, high high 20s, which isn't bad. Uh, last year we took a road trip from California to Colorado. Um, and we got actually, you know, it's about a thousand miles. We got really good mileage. Got about 41 MPG, which is great. We spent $200, you know, less than $200. You know, both ways, so yeah, it did really well. Um, you know, the, one of the things that that I don't like, there's actually, the, uh, there's a few, there's not that many of them, they're not really anything major, they're not a deal breaker, there's, um, and the, the, one of those is the radio. Now the radio is nice, it, it does have Bluetooth, it plays MP3s, XM radio, but the design of it is really weird, it relies just on this one. To, to navigate. Now, if you're looking to buy a new Elantra, you know, as of, you know, May, or, or yeah, May of 2013, the new Elantras come with a different radio that go with the two-knob setup, which is a lot more efficient, a lot better, and it looks better to me. Um, the other things, there are a couple of rattles, and they're not really consistent. They don't do it all the time. Very rarely, but I mean, usually when you move it, it's this one. This feels kind of flimsy. I don't know if you can see that there. Just kind of, which is not that bad. I don't know if you can hear that. The other one is here. And, yeah, there it is. It's so not that big of a deal. But it's just kind of, and it's only this spot because it doesn't do it here, doesn't do it down here, only does it there. So, not a big deal. Also, this is kind of flimsy here. Actually, no, that's not too bad. But yeah, I mean, overall, when you think of Hyundai, you don't think of quality. And, you know, this car has definitely changed that for me. It's, it's, it's a different ball game. This one has the uh, preferred package, which adds the alloy rims. Um the fog lights, the Bluetooth, and it actually has uh, heated seats, which is a nice touch on a car in this class. That, and they work really well. I mean, I live in California, so I don't use them all that much, but you know what? On those cold days, you know, few and far between, they, they, they warm up pretty fast, and they do work. Um, one of the things that is the uh, aesthetic design, this kind of fluidic sculpture, it's actually really cool. I just kind of like the way everything kind of flows and kind of cascades it here at the center stack it's it's really nice I mean to me it's 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 cool you always feel like you're kind of sitting 
kind of like a little bit forward. It's kind of hard to explain, but you know, I've never, or actually, just the way the center stack kind of goes back. It's it's it's, it's a nice aesthetic. It's pretty cool. It makes you feel like you're in a, kind of like in a cockpit. You know, it, and it's a roomy car. It's uh, you know, I'm five eight, about two hundred and fifty pounds, and this is with the seat way back, and you know, I have room to move. You know, I can rest my foot there. And, you know, it's stretching all the way, so I definitely don't drive it with the seat all the way back. So if you're tall, you know, you wouldn't have a problem with this. But yeah, it's a roomy car. Um, we have a, a four-month-old. We have a car seat in the back, and, you know, it fits just fine. So yeah, all in all, I mean, I would definitely recommend this car. I mean, I've sat in the new... Corollas, I've sat in the new Civics, and the new Sentras, and the new Dart, you know, I've, I've sat in a lot of cars, and I can definitely tell you this is on par better than a lot of them, I mean, I would definitely encourage you to take a look at Hyundai, I mean, it's a different ball game now, people, it really is, I mean, take this from a guy who would not be caught dead in a Hyundai two years ago, <laughs> and now I own two, so, yep. And uh, hopefully I'll be doing a same type of review with my 2013 Accent pretty soon. So be on the lookout for that. But yeah, I mean, if anybody has any questions, just, you know, message me. Comment. I'm very happy with this car so far. Gets great gas mileage. It's been, so far, very reliable over a year. I mean, we've, we've taken it everywhere. I mean, this was for a while, this was, you know, our only form of transportation, so it's definitely seen its, you know, a lot of miles. And then another thing I want to comment on real quick is it does have the soft touch dash, which is very nice. Very roomy. So, yeah. Thanks for watching, guys.